Hello everyone, welcome back to Farming Sim 17. We're going to get started today by placing this here sower over near this here field. We're not going to quite start yet since we have a lot of bales. Actually, we could just go pick those bales up quick and then we could start this. So we'll, we'll set it down and just kind of have it ready to go. Then we can... We are so close to another straw bale, but I don't think we can get it. There's like a few little tiny little dots of straw, which is okay. We'll have a... When we go to do hay, we'll basically have a full hay bale. Um, so that'll work just fine. We'll put this just over here because we are going to start mowing and kind of getting our hay ready to go. We'll fold this up. There we go. And let's go stack some straw. I think we will go put it by the, the pigs. I, we'll go with the, the Primor straw spitter outer machine. Um... Just, just for a while, just kind of see how it works, since I've never really used it. I think it's time to maybe try to use it. Uh, we'll have about, oh, I, I don't remember, 8 to 10 bales here. I don't want the minimap. Don't make me use it. Okay. Uh, we also need to start harvesting over there. Need to empty our soybeans. Um, we should have quite a few soybeans now, so if the price goes up to like, I don't even know, 2800 to 3000-ish for soybeans, we'll definitely empty them and sell them, since we are trying to save up for a big old tractor. We definitely need a tractor upgrade. These two will be nice to keep around for kind of our uh, hired workers. Uh, it'd be nice to get a really nice larger one for ourselves. For things like this, where we have to haul around a bunch of bales, because this thing is starting to... It's just not... It doesn't have quite the get-up that I would prefer hauling around stuff like this. But we need around $300,000 for uh, sort of the next upgrade of tractor that we're looking at. Okay, while that finishes, we can start more soybeans. Let's get this off the field then. You can tell that it's just sort of got some real slow acceleration. It's starting to get a little heavy. Um, we'll just go ahead and set this on the road. And then pick up our here tippers so that we can empty those. And well, let's see what the price of soybeans are. Um, here we go. Oh, I mean, that's pretty good. I don't know if it's going to get much better. And we have 40,000 plus 30,000. So we would make almost three times that. So 70, 140, almost 200,000 if we sold those right now. Might be worth it. Uh, we do have a really nice large tipper that we can use to transport. This can carry, I don't remember, 40, 40 some thousand. But we have this tipper here that can carry, I think, quite a bit more. Let's see. I haven't used it for so long, I have forgotten. So we have this guy that can hold 47. So not a ton more, um, but it is easier to carry one tipper than two. So let's go ahead and unload these. Is this soy as well? I think it is. So maybe it'd be worth waiting till this is... Eh, probably not. And that's soy. But we're always going to have soy. I think it's worth selling. I think it's going to be time to 
empty out our silos. We can only hold 100,000 anyway until we have to buy a new um, storage unit. Oh, I didn't even get that empty. Oh my. Okay, emptying the back one. There we go. Finish this one since I just sort of didn't. Good. Alright. We'll set these tippers down by this field. This is when it'd be nice to have one of those bigger tractors because this is going to get be a uh, heavy load. It also, uh, someone commented, pointed out that I could also buy a uh, one of these trucks. Um, cause not only are they cheaper than the biggest tractor, but you can also attach uh, like a coupler on the back. I, I, I can't think of it. Like a, a hitch on the back. And then we can pull stuff around with that, which actually works pretty well. And that is a lot cheaper. And then we could also buy tippers that have that use trailers. Ooh, eggs. Might as well. Uh oh, I'm stuck. Oh gosh. Okay. Might as well pick these up while we're driving by. That is, man, that is true. The next upgrade of tractors like three hundred thousand. Yeah, we can buy kind of the biggest, baddest trailer for 172 and then what you can do is just put a back attacher on it and you're good to go. Hmm. Interesting. Do we, we probably have that money now. And then it's just nice to have that because then if we want to buy a tipper like this that uses a, a semi, or this, that uses a semi, uh, we don't have to use the dolly thing, the uh, the dolly coupler, uh, t whatever. We can just use our big old semi truck. I'm wondering if it might be worth doing that now. And then we have that, hmm. Hmm, what, that was a nice comment. I wish I had my comments up to give that person credit. I apologize. I was not planning on, hmm. Wait, 40,000? Don't we have more soybeans? Oh yeah, that wasn't soybean, that was wheat. Okay, maybe we don't want to quite sell yet. Yeah, duh, this was wheat, that's why we have straw, okay. Uh, maybe we'll do these two fields and then see if the price is still around 2,800. Uh, and in the meantime, we can kind of keep working with our straw and get our hay ready and just sort of wait a little longer to sell our soybeans. But I do think we'll actually buy a semi-truck tr before we buy our tractor. Yeah, I think that's our plan. I mean, now that we can attach the back a hitch that that really makes a huge difference because then we can use that to pull around the tippers that we don't yeah I like it I think we're doing that love it great deal we did it so we'll let's see let's um might as well unload directly into this and we'll just sort of have this tipper ready to go we'll, we'll fill it up and as soon as this is all the way full we will uh, go sell, I think. So maybe I, yeah, ignore what I said. I think we are going to sell soybeans. We're just going to wait for this to get full. So let's... Oh my gosh, the manure. We need more. Um, where's our... This is probably here. Do we need to feed animals? Probably. We usually... Oh my goodness. When did this happen? Oh my gosh. Oh, these four animals. Okay, we are... Okay, let's let's work on the sheep first. Those are the easiest things to do. So let's disconnect this and get this tipper for hay. Holy cow, I... Wow. I got so involved with... Um...
the the bailing, sorry. I got so involved with bailing that I completely neglected. Uh oh. Uh oh, we need to start mowing. So as soon as that worker is done planting, we'll you we'll get that tractor back and begin mowing uh, both of these fields so that we can uh, get some loose hay in our barn. We also need hay for bales, but I think that's going to have to go on the back burner for a little bit. Maybe not, though. It might be worth just getting the bales and getting our power food mixture. Because if we look at our cows, we don't really need to do this because the power food will take care of it, but we do need grass. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're... We got behind. That's alright. We'll, we'll catch up. We will catch up. We do have a couple full pallets over there, so that'll get us some money as well when we're ready. Um, but I think we're going to put selling stuff on the back burner as well, since we need to catch up here. That's, yeah, it's not going to do it. Okay. Um, oh yeah, we, we can just use this tractor to mow. Let's just do that. I don't know why I was thinking we had to use the other one. This one's not going to be going off to the the stores anytime soon. Thank you. Really wish they'd patch the Great Demand notifications so that it didn't bring up the minimap. Okay. Um... Yeah, I think our first priority will be mowing. Before we can get grass or hay, we need to mow. I'm going to just set these tippers here. Um, probably not the greatest place, but we just need to just need to get moving on this. Oh. Someone well, okay. If we just need grass, which we do... Um, I had a lot of comments a few episodes ago that said, why didn't I put the mower on the front and the windrower on the back and just do them both at the same time? I think it's because the last time I tried that, I had a smaller tractor. So I either didn't have the power or I didn't have the horsepower. So let's see if this works now that we have this nice... Uh, Lamborghini tractor. Oops. Want to unfold. We can unfold this. Unfold all the things. Let's get a nice straight shot here. Well, wasn't quite what I wanted, but we can back up. Okay, let's see if this works. I don't know why it wouldn't. So let's lower. And we need to lower this. Turn this bad boy on. 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 Everything's on. Oh yes. There we go. I know we need hay, but we might as well fill up a loading wagon with grass since our cows do need uh, straight straight grass as well as silage or hay in our power foods. So um, I will go ahead and complete this field um, while you enjoy some sped up camera and a little bit of music.
Okay, that seemed to work pretty well. Um, that also tells me that we might... Oops. Let's finish this little row here. There we go. We might be able to... Uh, we should probably lift this before I start driving too much. There we go. We might be able to do the same thing over on this field. Except we'll attach our tether to the back. Um, we'll just kind of messily leave the wind rower there. We'll need it after we're done with this hay. But I don't see why we can't do the same thing and just ted as we go. Um, I don't think we can, like, over ted, right? I mean, maybe. I, I actually have no idea. Um, but I, I don't think we can make the grass, like, we can't, like, destroy it. So I th think we'll be good to go. We won't have a lot of hay. Um, while that's unfolding, let's get in this guy. And empty it out. Then we can start him over there. I want to see if I can get the worker to do both jobs of mowing and tedding. Because um, then we can get our other tractor and go find our loading wagon, which I think I brought back. Oh. Okay, this is a large, large tipper, but we can do this. There we go. Um. Okay, I did finish. I see what it's doing. We are going to cut through our field. It'll be fine. The field's tough. We're good. We'll put this sower away. I don't want to mess with sowing for a bit. We got many things to do. Before we want to mess with that. Uh, we'll probably give it a quick scrub, however. it's We always have time to clean. Um, if I go... Got to decouple these, or else it doesn't get clean. Okay. Take a few seconds here. So, oh, I should have started the mower. That's all right. Again, if, if there's ever a question of priority, we at least know that keeping our vehicles clean is probably number one before anything else. For sure. Ah, uh, that's so much better. See? Now everything's just... just seems better. The cows are fine. The sheep are fine. Because our tractor is clean. Let's see if we can get a worker to do both things. Okay. Um, nope. Um, I wonder if I start it. Let's start it and then I'll hit the old H button. Okay, we'll, uh, We'll see how that does, how that do. Uh, might not go well, but we'll also stand on our tractor and watch the sunrise. And we can farm during the day. Uh, yeah, our milk profit is down considerably. Still have some soybeans in here, which is fine. 270 won't do much. We can lower our pipe in, please. And then we can go over and start our soybean harvest over here. It looks like the worker's doing okay. Let's get one tractor. And our loading wagon should be... oh gosh. 
Um, maybe it's still at our cows? Either that or it's up here. I didn't see it though. We should have one or two of them. Um, alright. Where'd they go? We can look in our menu here. Should be... I'm not quite sure of which... There we go. Um, this is... Oh, they're both by our cows. Shucks. And then this is our water. Okay, so we just need to drive a tractor down to our cows. Um, let's go ahead and set this down. Because the quickest way to get to our cows is, of course, to reset to the shop. We can also just take our power food down to our cows, our uh, little power food mixer here. We can also water... Okay, so this will be good. We can get water to our cows. I think they're empty completely. It's 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 not looking great. Oh, we can also use this for straw. Um, instead of buying a Primor mixer... Let me just show you what I mean by that, because I'm probably saying the complete wrong thing. This thing, the Primor 15070, that shoots straw out. Instead of using this for our cows, we'll just use this mixer. As long as it's empty, we can just put straw in and feed it. Um, so we also need a front loader down here. Because then I could do that right now. Maybe we'll do that right now. Well, right now we need one of these loaders. So let's do that. Let's grab this. There might be some grass in one of these. I don't remember if I've emptied it or not. Oh, great. Okay, we have a little bit. Probably not. It'll be fine. Um, never a bad thing to fill up another one, but let's go ahead and see if this can empty. There we go. All right. Whew, okay. We'll get back to the farm. Okay, before I pick this up, I want to check on our worker. Oh gosh. Um, you know, it's, it's definitely taking longer than if I would have just done it myself. But it's also nice because I don't have to do it myself. So... Yeah, he's not doing the most efficient path, is he? Um, alright. You're done. We might as well just finish this ourselves. Alright. Systems are ready. Yeah, this will go a lot faster. Okay, I think we'll end... Here, I will go ahead and speed up the camera and finish uh, tedding this grass. I will also pick up our grass over there so that all of that is completed at the beginning of our next episode. So, um, whew, our poor cows. We'll get to them. We'll, we'll get them fed. There's just a lot to do in the meantime. Whoops. Oh, well. Okay, should only be one more pass here. So... There we go. Alright, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Hope to see you next time. Have yourselves a very nice day.